Those clans laugh from Tampa, but he won't really man. Cause I'm doing this thing called rap shit. Flowing on the stage while you stiff erection. Korean boy on the mic check one, two, and Yo, what's going on, everybody? This is your host with the most from the West Coast, Jazz and 55 bringing you another NBA 2K11 commentary. This time it's an association video with my team, the Detroit Pistons. Uh, I got Champy Papadopoulos, Jake Love, Jack Moon, Campaign, and Josh Smith, which I recently got trade for him. And then I trade away Greg Monroe, so in my opinion, that was a good trade. But uh, what I wanted to talk about today is uh, it's a common, it's a common thing that all commentators want to know is uh what like what makes you what do you subscribers um want like what makes you watch commentator like why would you watch me over other commentators or why would you watch other commentators over me uh it's just a common question because obviously there are like many people who don't get enough who don't get the views like as much as they have subscribers if you get what i mean like you could have like what thousand subscribers and then only 300 400 view your videos um it's, it's a it's a common thing that happens with all commentators and you know it's kind of frustrating um but a lot of them are dead subs which means they close their channel they don't really like to watch anymore etc but uh you know what makes you want to watch one of my videos or one of other commentators videos because for me it's uh I, norm I normally really like short videos like you know typically like two to uh two to eight minute videos like those are my my favorite ones um just because i could just watch them at any time but uh if, if it's a commentator i really like then i'll watch it of course but uh I'm, I'm asking you guys, so is it about the commentary, is it about the gameplay, is it about the length of video, is it about what type of game it is? Because I know many people don't watch my Call of Duty videos and maybe that's why. Maybe I'm just known uh, to be an mb 2 k commentator and not really anything else, which I hope that's not the case because I, I want to branch off into other games, not just mb 2 k 11 um, But And then commentary-wise, it might be... You know, you might get like a hundred, two hundred point game, but you you just have a terrible voice or just not be in a good mood, so your commentary might be off. Will will people watch that? Uh, or is it or is it gameplay? Like you can have an amazing commentary, but the game you're playing is just stupid, like Barbie Barbie dolls, 2011. I don't know. Um, so it all for me, like I said, it's all about. It's it's about a commentator I like so yeah most a lot of it's about commentary, um, because most of the time I could just if it's a good commentator and I don't really care about their gameplay I could just sit down, um, do some homework, uh, maybe edit a video and then just listen to their commentary. It's very nice, uh, but yeah that's what I want to ask you guys and what what can I improve on because um, maybe I need to play other games. That's that's what I'm guessing. Maybe make my commentary more interesting. I don't know how I can do that, honestly. <laughs> uh, I'm not saying my is the best, but I just don't know how to, you know, change it or how to make it better. Maybe make a smooth beat, maybe to be more entertaining. But uh, I just wanted to ask you that, the guys, that because you know, yeah, I just wanted to ask you guys that because. I just want to. I wanted your input because, you know, your guys' feedback really means a lot to me. Unless it's like, oh, you're gay, that was gay, uh, you suck. Um, otherwise, I'll appreciate it. I mean, I like constructive criticism. I don't really like negative feedback. See, you could put something, like, you could write you're gay, but in a better way. Like, you can say, oh, this commentary could have been better if you'd done this, this, or this. That could be a lot better. I mean, just nobody really likes it if you just say, oh, you're gay, and then that's all you say. But, um, anyways, uh, oh, God, I forgot. What was, oh, that was a nice slam. I, I freaked out when that happened. Um, um, I had a live, I actually had a live commentary for this plan down, but then I, I decided to scrap that and just make a random commentary over it. Uh, so, that explains that, but um, what I'm, what I'm, uh, one of the common questions I have on my channel is that intro, um, 
uh, what what song is it? Where did you get it from? It's by my friends, BT Fly Music. They closed their channel for reasons I don't know. They closed. It's not. It's none of my business. But uh, I think they did make a new channel, so you guys can subscribe to that. Uh, they're really talented artists. Um, I really respect them as artists because they are they are good. They're they're friends of mine. So um, yeah, they're really good at music. <laughs> but um. Ooh, MB2K12, there's been a lot of information, and what I've decided is that maybe you guys aren't really interested in, like, all this new MB2K12 information, so I've decided to not do that anymore. I'll leave that up to other commentators, uh, because it's, it, it just seems so bad, because it may seem like I'm only doing it for views, or for money, or etc., um, so I don't want I don't want an image like that to make it seem like I'm only doing it for money because um, I'm definitely doing it because I wanted to give you guys this information just in case you didn't know or you know stuff like that. So I'll be scrapping all MBTK12 content um, until it actually comes out or if I really find something interesting. And uh, so pretty much what you'll see from this channel until MBTK12 is some. A little bit more NBTK11, but not as much as now because I am getting Madden 12 and I'm gonna play the shit out of that. Um, playing some Ultimate Team, Superstar, uh, online franchise. So, you know, it'll be interesting when it comes out. Uh, I'll be playing a lot of it. So, be ready for that. I hope I can gain a little bit of a fan base of Madden because I know many guys don't really like Madden. Honestly, I think the only thing you guys like is from me is just NBTK content. So I hope I can branch out a little bit more, but other than that, uh, you know, this commentary is coming up to a close. We do re beat the Memphis Grizzlies pretty badly, and uh, in my opinion, I think Josh Smith did really well this game. Uh, he did get 19 points in total, and to, you know, just to show off, I just cross over my Conley and just slam. Uh, so, you know, there's going to be more of this association, more of my player. And then once I get Madden, shitload of Madden. That's all I gotta say. Uh, but for the last shot, uh, I just take a random shot just to just to brag in their face. But other than that, my name is Shadow 155. I hope you guys enjoyed this commentary, and uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Have a nice day. Peace. Dominant they can be. Well, this is one of those dreamlike games for a coach. Well, it's time to say so long. For Clark Kellogg, Doris Burke, this is Kevin Harlan, along with our 2K Sports crew, thanking you for tuning in. Now it's time to present our Jordan brand player of the game, Josh Smith.